Hi, I'm Olivia, dietitian here at the MLK Health Center and Pharmacy. And in this video, we're going to be making several different refreshing summer beverages. These drinks are going to be lower in sugar and they're non-alcoholic. So if you're avoiding alcohol for any reason or you're trying to limit, these are going to be some good drink alternatives. The first drink that we're going to be making is a rosemary grapefruit seltzer. And so we're going to need some fresh rosemary, some grapefruit, and a grapefruit seltzer. You can use whatever brand you like. So we're going to need about um, two ounces or a quarter cup of grapefruit juice. So I'm just going to cut some grapefruit and get that juice. Careful not to get any seeds. Now we're going to add some rosemary to a cup. If you have a mortar and pestle, then great. We are, we do not, we are just using a cup that we have. And so we're going to put in some rosemary. If you really like the taste of rosemary, feel free to add more. If you don't, you can do less. And we're just going to kind of use the back of this, these little tongs to just kind of press into the rosemary. And this just breaks it up a little bit so that those oils come out and it's super, it's very fragrant. And this is going to help flavor our juice. We're not grinding it to a pulp. It just needs to be mashed a little bit. And that's it. You can smell, already smell it. And my fingers smell like rosemary, so it doesn't take a lot. I'm going to add this grapefruit juice to the rosemary and we're going to give it a gentle shake. Next, choose your glass that your preferred drinking glass and we're going to add some ice to it and we're going to add some seltzer to this iced glass. It's about two ounces, which is again about a quarter cup. You could also add a little bit more if you wanted it to maybe not be so grapefruity. This is grapefruit flavored, of course, but this was this is uh, seltzer water, so it would dilute it a little bit more if you wanted uh, maybe it not to be quite so strong. It's up to you. And since we don't want any bits of, um, tiny bits of rosemary in our drink, I'm going to just use this lid to kind of hold it back. I think one tiny bit still escaped through, but that's okay. If you have a strainer, you could do that. Or if you don't care, then you don't. Have, you could skip this part because you are also welcome to garnish this drink with some rosemary, but I don't want tiny little bits getting through where I have to chew. And this is our rosemary grapefruit seltzer. Like I said, if you wanted a bit more drink, you could add more of the seltzer water to it as opposed to adding more juice. And that will just help with not having too much sugar in your drink. Our next drink is going to be a passion fruit sangria. And so what we're going to be using is some of this iced passion tea concentrate. We're going to be using some pomegranate juice, club soda, and freshly squeezed orange juice. So you'll want to get your cup, add some ice to it. We're going to add a quarter cup of pomegranate juice. A quarter cup of the tea concentrate and a quarter cup of the club soda. And then our last ingredient is just going to be two tablespoons of freshly squeezed orange juice. I'm just going to eyeball this. So I got a nice thick wedge of orange slice here and I'm just going to go with it, but feel free to measure. Once you have all that together, give it a stir. And in true sangria form, we're going to add some fresh fruit. I added some blackberries and an orange wedge to our cup. 
Our next drink, this is actually my favorite, this is a ginger beer with lime. And so ginger beer is basically just like ginger ale. It just is a little bit more spicy because it's got more ginger in it. It does have sugar in it, so we are going to cut it with some club soda so it's not as sweet. So we're gonna start with our cup and we are going to run some lime around the rim and put some salt on our plate and salt our rim. This is what makes it my favorite. I love this, this part. Add some ice. I'm gonna go ahead and just throw this lime in here because I like mine to be very limey. We're gonna juice half, a, juice half a lime into this. You can do more or less if you don't like it too limey, but I love the lime flavor. I'm going to add just about half of this can of ginger beer and then we'll fill the rest up with club soda. Our last drink is a coconut lemon refresher. So we're going to be using some fresh lemon juice. Now I like a lot of lemon, so I'm gonna do a half a lemon, but feel free to cut back if you think that's too much. If you're, if you're having trouble juicing any of these citrus fruit, rolling them helps before, or also popping them in the microwave for a few seconds helps to loosen up all that juice. I did not do that, so using some grip strength. <laughs> and we're just gonna do half an ounce coconut water and club soda from here. And there you have it, four refreshing summer beverages. Let us know if you try any of these and which one's your favorite. Thanks for watching.